welcome back to cad cam tutorial today we are going to design a simple house and here we will see how to fix the all material bricks concrete and wall it is very interesting and very it's a kind of fun so let's see how to do do it in solid works we will design our a simple house i hope you like it let's see how to do in solid works Now let's start to build a house. Choose top plane, a sketch. Select here center rectangle and draw a rectangle. Okay. Now select vertical and horizontal rectangle and make uh, line make relation equal. Now keep the length twenty three thousand mm. Okay. Now select offset. Keep here hundred mm. See, it's showing outside. Make reverse inside. Okay. Now select a line and start to draw our house from here. connect with this line exit now we will define this length ten thousand five hundred fifty mm Select nine thousand. This one also keep nine thousand. Four thousand two hundred eighty-five mm. Okay. Now define the distance from outer line. Six thousand. Seven thousand five mm. Or uh, just reduce it. Six thousand mm. And this one make. Nine thousand mm. Okay, this is what we need. Okay, now choose offset entities and here we will define the one hundred thirty mm. Select the line, select here chain, select inside. Okay, again choose line. Exit. Again, choose line. Okay. This is the geometry what we need. Again, choose cancel. Again, choose offset entity. And now select here nine hundred mm. and select this outer line see here it's showing outside okay select a line and connect it exit line and connect this line exit 
now choose trim entities and trim this okay now let's define this length Eighteen hundred seventy-five mm, and this must nine hundred. Okay. Now exit from the sketch. Select sweep boss base. Select this inside face only. Choose only inside face and. Increase ten mm only. Okay. See it is increased. Go to appearance. Paving. Stone. And select here wet concrete two D. Okay. See, this is the wet concrete. Okay. Now again, select this previous sketch. Select here extruded boss. Now this time, select this face and extrude up to. Two hundred mm. Okay. Now select this structure. Wet concrete. Select this top face. Again, go to go to structural, and here you will find cobble stone, cobble stone, and select here cobble stone two. Concrete already defined, so we will select the face top face. Okay, now this is the base uh, round shape around the boundary of wall. Now again, select the previous structure, previous sketch. Select here extruded boss. Now this time, select this face. See, we selected this small thin wall and extrude up to. Eight thousand mm. This is the uh, our building wall or our bungalow wall. Okay. See. Now select this ex extruded face, and we will assign some white material. white paint now again go to brick stone brick and here you will find fire brick select this face or select this all face all outside face Fire brick. See. The bricks look very different. So let's say another brick. No, this also not better. Undo the process. Okay, this brick is better. Now select this face sketch normal. Select line up to this line. Exit. Now define the dimension. Forty-five 
47 50 mm now distance from here to this point 1350 mm Sixteen hundred mm. Okay. Now we want to cut it. So select extruded cut. Drag towards outward direction. Okay. Now see we cut a triangle shape for a cover. Now see it is, it is uh, open from bottom side. So choose our first structure. Select extrude. Select this inside face. And now we want to extrude up to 1000 mm. You can see inside. And here select this face also and select this face also so this become a one surface three region okay now select this inside face and we will assign some wooden floor go to fabric organic wood apply polished beach this is the floor inside floor okay now select this face sketch normal select a line select this point exit again select line and up to here then come down and draw a vertical line make sure it is vertical delete it now define the dimension or better choose offset entity keep 170 mm and select this line okay choose a line connect vertical connect in both direction exit choose trim entity and trim this unnecessary part okay now let's define the gap twelve hundred fifty mm okay now select this line collinear again choose the smart dimension twelve hundred fifty mm okay and select extruded boss now in one side extrude up to 550 mm and in direction 2 extrude 10550 plus 900 mm okay now this is the roof select this face sketch normal here we want to create some balcony so select line connect up to this end exit now again choose line up to here and connect with this line and connect up to this point okay now select here corner rectangle 
draw a corner rectangle. Now let's define gap eleven hundred mm. thousand mm okay and select extruded cut now this two portion we want to cut here choose up to surface select this wall as a surface okay now see this face should be brick stone Okay. Now select this face, sketch normal, and here we will make some window. Select corner rectangle. Exit. Now let's define. Eight hundred mm, sixteen hundred length and height. Keep sixteen hundred. And keep the gap thirteen hundred mm. Now we will make some relation. Select these two lines. Collinear. Collinear. Select and again equal. Okay. Now define the gap between these two lines. Two thousand nine hundred. Okay. Now select these two upper lines and make relation equal. This line and this line. It's already collinear. Now define the distance from bottom line. Four thousand seven hundred fifty mm. Okay. Now select this line and this line and make relation equal. Okay. Now see. Select extruded cut, and here choose up to next. See. Okay. Select this face. Choose fire brick. Now here we want to make a door. So select this face, sketch normal. Select corner rectangle, and select Select this point and this point coincide. Now let's define three thousand by seventeen hundred mm. Okay. Now select extruded boss and extrude up to thousand mm. Okay. Now select this face and assign some architectural stone.
select floor tile okay this is the floor tile and this part should be wet concrete paving wet concrete okay select this face a sketch normal select corner rectangle draw a rectangle keep the length Two thousand mm. Seventeen hundred mm. And the width thirteen hundred mm. And the distance from this line. Seven hundred mm. Okay. Now select extruded cut and keep here up to next. Okay. Now it's open for a door. Select this face, a sketch, normal, and here we will make ladder. Choose a line. Okay. Equal. Select this three lines and make again relation equal. Fifty-five. Fifty-five. Okay. Select line and close this geometry. Exit. Now select extruded boss. Select reverse direction or choose here up to vertex, and select the sharp edge as a vertex. See the ladder going. Okay. So this is the our ladder. Now here we want to make some this cut out. Edit and select this sixteen hundred fifty mm. Exit. Okay, this cutout we changed. Now select this face, sketch normal, and here also we want to make some cutouts for window. Select corner rectangle. draw some small window now first we will make some relation collinear uh just undo the process twelve hundred Sixteen hundred by sixteen hundred. Okay. Equal. Equal. Collinear. Okay. Now define the gap.
थर्टीन हंड्रेड एम एम दिस वी कीप सिक्सटीन हंड्रेड फिफ्टी एम एम ओके फोर हंड्रेड बाय फोर हंड्रेड ओके फोर हंड्रेड एम एम सेलेक्ट दिस गैप नाइनटीन हंड्रेड एम एम एलेवन हंड्रेड बाय नाइन हंड्रेड एम एम ओके Now select these two lines and make relation collinear. Okay. Four hundred. Okay. Now let's cut. Choose here up to next. Okay. Now see we cut the windows. Now select this cutout. Select this sketch. Extruded cut. Clear. And here select only one rectangle, and make the length nine thousand eight eighty one mm. See. Okay. Select this face, and here also we want to make a rectangle window. Sixteen hundred fifty mm. Sixteen hundred by sixteen, sixteen hundred mm. Collinear, okay. And select extruded cut. Select here up to next, okay. Now we cut this. Now select this out, this face, and we we want to make here garden. so we will assign some grass material here so go to organic and here you will find miscellaneous and see here you will find grass so just drag again select this face grass okay now see the bottom the earth become uh, our garden become grass now we will change the dimension for this door edit 2100 mm 1100 mm Eight hundred mm. Okay. Now select this face, a sketch, and here we will make some window. Choose corner rectangle. Draw two rectangles. First, make relation equal. Equal. Select these two lines, symmetric. Now let's assign the dimension. Thirteen hundred mm. Eleven hundred 
1650 mm thirteen hundred mm. Now let's define sixteen hundred by sixteen hundred mm. Okay. Now select extruded cut. Keep here up to next. Okay. See the wall is cut. Now here we want to make second floor. So how we, we will make second floor? Just choose our first dimension. Extruded boss. Select this inside. Clear. Select this face, this face and this face. These three faces first choose offset. 3900 mm and the floor thickness only 100 mm. You can see here it's going to create inside a floor. Okay. Now let's see see a floor created. Select this fl floor, go to wood, choose polished beach. See this is the second floor of our bungalow, our house. Select this face and go to architectural material. Okay, select this face also, assign red concrete, that's it. Now this balcony open space, we want to close it by wall and make a door and window. So choose our first geometry. Select here extruded boss and you can see this small passage that's it. Select here up to surface. Select this surface. Okay. Now it's close. So select this face sketch normal. First draw a center line. exit choose corner rectangle first make door make two doors then make window exit first define the length 2100 mm by 1100 mm Eleven hundred ten mm from bo bottom face, three hundred mm. Okay, now we will make some relation. Equal, select this face, equal. Now select these two lines, collinear. Okay. Now let's define the gap. 810 mm. Sixteen hundred by sixteen hundred. Okay. Now let's define the some relation. Equal. Equal. 
equal relation okay collinear okay let's define uh, better to keep 600 mm distance from bottom line let's say 1800 mm Thirteen hundred mm, the height. Okay, and select extruded cut. Choose here up to next. Okay. Now see, we created the window and door for balcony, first floor and second floor. Select this face, sketch, normal. Choose corner rectangle. Select 600 mm. Increase it 1000 mm. Okay, and select extruded cut. Cut here. Okay. Now see. We created a shape. Now the last one we will make the boundary. So choose our first geometry, extruded boss, and second this wall, outer wall. You can see. Make 1500 mm. Okay. And keep this wall wet concrete. Now, see, this is the, our beautiful bungalow. Now, we will assign some window also so it looks pretty nice. First save this geometry, house, now let's make the window, now we will make the next part window, window assembly for our house choose front plane sketch and here select center rectangle draw a rectangle keep the dimension 1600 by 1600 mm okay now select offset entities keep 30 mm select the line reverse we want to make inside okay now select extruded boss and extrude up to 50 mm okay now select fillet keep 10 mm and select the outer face okay now again choose front plane sketch normal select here corner rectangle uh, first define the center line Okay, this is the center line. Draw from one end to another end. In the same way, a horizontal center line. Select here corner rectangle. Now select this face to bottom face
select from here up to here okay now let's define 4 mm Four mm, and select the overall length, forty mm, and select this one overall length, fifty mm. Okay. Now here we will make one relation. Select these three lines and make relation symmetric. Okay. Now see this drawing is defined. The same way we will do it here. Select these three line, symmetric. Okay. Now this geometry is fully defined. Select extruded boss. See, and extrude up to sixty mm. Okay. Choose fillet. Keep ten mm. Select this face. Okay. now we will assign the material so select this four parts and go to wood choose here rosewood polished rosewood see this is the our material now in open spaces we will fix the glass choose front plane sketch normal choose corner rectangle and select draw a glass from this end to this end okay now select extruded boss and extrude up to 10 mm only okay now you see it is not transparent so select this glass and go to glass clear glass edit here select unmerge result okay see it is transparent glass now save this window now let's start the assembly of our house now let's start the assembly of house choose new assembly okay now see this is the window of solid works assembly let's browse find out the files i kept the file in house okay select house and window open by default the house become fixed and window will be floating choose here plane press control key undo escape press undo okay okay now we will make multiple number of copies 1 2 3 4 5 how many windows 4 4 4 6 6 3 9 9 9 2 9 11 so rotate the window move the window okay to 
use mat select this face clear this wall mat select this bottom line okay now select or select this edge directly select inside edge okay this edge take it from another window enter from another window okay and select now see okay the one window is fixed so i will not show to fix all the window i will just show you to fix this two window okay now select this okay select this back li vertical line and select this line coincident relation see these two windows are fixed okay drag it this back side edge all the mat should be edge mat okay so all are the coincident mat nothing more coincident flip okay select this back okay okay so this is the coincident mat we use coincident mat and fix all the windows i am going to skip to fix other windows to just show you how to fix this so i am going to skip this step now you can see here i fix all the windows one by one it's a easy and simple method just coincident see each and every window we fix so this is the our simple model house i hope you enjoyed we put all the material and uh, stones and uh, many materials we used here I hope you like it please subscribe our channel for more video and more projects in solid box don't forget to share and like our videos thanks for watching